Welcome to another fabulous Kincaid auction. Saturday, August the 21st at 10 a.m. I'm going to be out here at the Harville Estate at 4727 Acorn Drive in Lakeland, Florida, 33810. Showing you this house right here. It's a double wide mobile home with a big uh, enclosed front room on it. There's the utility building on it. Has a rear porch on it right there. You just saw the carport. That's a 10 by, I mean a 24 by 24 carport. We're going to look around the outside first. There's a shot of the back of the of uh, the unit. Has a roof over on it. Really a nice lot with lots of shade trees. Actually the lot size. There's a water pump right there. A little jet pump. Pumps good water too. I've tasted that. It also has a Culligan system there. I think that's rented. Out in the back is a horse pasture uh, where you can put a horse on there. I said the lot size was 1.23 acres. It's about 330 feet deep and 165 feet across the front. All of it's fenced and then there's a cross fence there, of course, where you can keep a cow or livestock, whatever you'd like to keep out there. Then coming back into the yard here, we're going to be looking at some more of the trees. You can see the unit with the roof over on it right there. Nice spacious yard there. There's a shot of the air conditioner for it and that thing gives that house just freezing cold inside. We're inside now looking at the living room. And uh, we're going to look around there. We're selling the personal property too. So we'll be selling the furnishings and all of the uh, collectibles that she is, uh, the Ms. Harville had amassed over the period. She'd been there for a long time. We're looking out at the uh, main bathroom right there. I, uh, all of the floors seem to be solid in the house. Uh, some of the, the, that particular bathroom might be a little bit springy, but I couldn't find any rod in it. There's a picture of one of the bedrooms. That's what I'd call bedroom number two. And it's uh, uh, just like a, about a 10 by 12 bedroom with a uh, walk walk uh, with a little closet in down in it using the bifold doors if you want to. You're going to need to probably put some carpet in here in some of the areas. Some of it hasn't been uh, done in a long time. You may want to address some of the window treatments on it. But it's a nice solid house right there. It was built in 1985. There's a, a shot of the other bed, one of the other bedrooms. There's two on that end of the house. And it's probably about a 10 by 12 or a 12 by 12, something like that. And it has the same type of closet configuration. They didn't use bifold doors, they used uh, curtains. This is a shot of the utility area. The, they've moved their utility outside. This, that was going to the back door. Here's the kitchen right there. The countertops are all tile. It has a nice, nice layout on the kitchen. And it's got pretty decent cabinets in it too, with lots of storage space. It gives you a picture of the refrigerator and some more shot of the kitchen right there, the electric range, and some more shots of the cabinets there looking out into the dining room. Now we're going to walk into the dining room. Wow, look at it. Nice spacious dining room and it's, uh, you, you can't help but notice that there's a lot of collectibles in there that you can come. We're going to be selling them too. And glassware, plus all of the furniture. There's another shot looking back from the dining room into the kitchen. And now we're walking into what you'd probably call the master bedroom. And it has a, it's a nice large be, uh, bedroom with a closet on it. And then you're going to walk, we're going to walk from the, from the bedroom into the bathroom, which is just off the bedroom. Notice there's no carpet on the floor there, but it is solid plywood floors. And that's a picture of the of the master, what I call the master bath. Has a nice little jacuzzi style tub in it and a shower stall. Get a good picture of it there. You can see what you have. And now we're going to come out into the front room. Now the front room's on a concrete slab. It's down on the ground level. And, but it has a nice heater in it, one of those nice wood burning stoves over in the corner. 
And we're going to need to uh, leave that with the building because it was just recently put in. I can tell it has a uh, special chimney and everything. There's the steps going up into the living room. But that's all air conditioned just like the rest of the house. Don't miss this auction, folks. It's going to be fun and exciting. We're going to have a lot of other things available out here, too. Uh, particularly, we have from another estate some machine tools, some welding equipment, and also we're anticipating that perhaps we'll get from an, another estate uh, some more antiques and collectibles. It's going to be a lot of fun. Saturday's going to be a big day. Don't miss it. But in case you can't be there, we do offer online bidding through proxy bid. See you at the auction.